I'm Laila Werbi Zangio, the current um, African age group champion in triathlon and Ghana's female champion as well. I'm so happy to know and hear that Ghana is hosting the West African Zone 1 Championship. In fact, I've been so happy about hearing that and it feels good to finally host one and then try competing to be the best. Well, towards the championship, as a team we've been training for a while now with the help of um, Spencer, that's our triathlon coach. For some time now we've had him come on board to help us with training sessions. So as a team I think we're working towards it. We're working very, very hard and as usual we would all try our best because that's what we always do. We just try our best and we hope you're there to support us as well. Registration is ongoing. We need a lot of you who can register to actually be part of it. It's, it's a three sport, swim, cycling and running. If you can do all three, you can come with a relay team and then register as a group and then do it together. So registration is ongoing. For more information on that, you can follow Ghana Triathlon on Instagram, on Twitter and on Facebook. We, we always do our best, so I'm expecting a lot of competition because we have nine West African countries coming and, and with this sport, you don't, you can't really tell because you don't know who is coming. You don't meet the same people every time. So we've worked so hard and I'm expecting to win. As usual, I'm expecting to win. So that's my expectation. I want to win. I've worked so hard. So I feel I have to win. Well, I'd like to thank um, the whole, should I say administration or the whole Lincoln Community School team for granting me the opportunity to be able to train and work at the same time. Most people can't allow that but I'm very grateful to have Lincoln to support me in doing all this training and working at the same time. Thank you so much Lincoln Community School. I would also like to thank Kimpiski and Cowbell for making this happening for us. Like it's it's amazing to have people have your back, especially when you're hosting. This is going to put Ghana on the ITU mark and then if things go as we've planned, probably we'll get a chance to host more and more competitions. So I want to say a big thank you to Kempiski and Carbo for making this possible. Best. I don't want to say host and win, but we'll try our best. Like, it's not easy. Every country that's coming is coming with their best. So we can't just claim it. We've worked hard. We're just hoping like it, it works out for us, like as usual. But most likely, it's a host and win. <laughs>